Yes, it's finally time to find out who will be the winner of our Eurovision 2022. We will start with a jury voting, where 40 YouTube channels from across the world will give points to their favorite songs. With everything being said, let's finally find out the winner of the Eurovision Song Contest 2022!
On the screen, you can see the current scoreboard after the jury voting. Sweden topped it with 299 points, followed by Greece, the Netherlands and Spain. As we can interview Cornelia right now, let's just watch a short recap of the current top 10. Okay, we have just watched the current top 10, but everything can still change with your votes. Exactly! Almost 15,000 votes were casted, and they will all be essential to determine this year's winner. The points you see on the board right now are the votes from the YouTube jury, but everything will change because these are only half of tonight's votes. The order you see on the board is the order we'll use to announce the public votes. We'll start with the country that got the lowest score from the jury voting and we will go up country by country until we reach Sweden, which is currently winning. Alright, I think we're ready to do this. Let's start with Lithuania, who got the least amount of jury points. And the public gave to Lithuania additional 56 points. Next up we have Germany. Germany, you got twenty six points. We'll continue with Montenegro, which received from the telephone thirty nine points. Denmark will now receive their televoting points. And Denmark, you receive 18 points. Moving on to Ireland, who got from the public 49 points. Now we have Estonia that got additional 67 points. It's Romania's turn now. And the public gave to Romania 55 points. Now we move on to Norway. Norway, you received from the public votes 90 points. Next up is Serbia. Serbia, you got 96 points. Only 16 countries are left. So now let's move on to Ukraine. Ukraine, you have received from the televote 87 points. We continue with Armenia, who received an additional 55 points.
We now go to Czech Republic. And Czech Republic has got 88 points. Next up is France. France has received from the public 98 points. Let's move on to the United Kingdom. They received 99 points. The next country is Poland, and Poland received from the public votes 118 points! Only 10 more countries are left to receive their votes. So now, let's take a look at Australia. Australia, you received 60 points. Next up, Austria. Austria received from the public vote 121 points We're getting closer and closer to find out the winner of our Eurovision 2022 Moving on to Portugal Portugal, you got from the public votes 69 points All right, next up is Albania. Albania, you have received from the public 111 points. The next country to receive their points is Italy. Italy, you received 139 points! Five countries left. The winner is one of these five. But who will it be? Let's find out. Cyprus, the public gave you additional 109 points. And now we're moving on to Spain. Spain, you received from the public 100. Are you ready? Spain received 200 points, which means that Spain is now in the lead. Spain is in the lead at the moment, but any of these countries can still take the current first place. Alright, moving on to the Netherlands. The Netherlands, you received from the public vote 163 points, which is not enough to pass Spain. It's Greece's turn right now. Will they get enough points to win? We will see. The public decided to give Greece additional... 131 points! And this is the moment we've all been waiting for. 
either Spain or Sweden will be the winner of Eurovision 2022. Sweden needs at least 103 points from the televote to win the contest. But will they receive enough points to win? Let's find out. Sweden, the public decided to give you... One hundred and seventy-six points, which makes Sweden the winner of our Eurovision 2022. Cornelia Jacobs is the winner. Congratulations, Sweden! Cornelia started her music career as a member of the girl group Love Generation, who participated in Melody Festival in 2011 and 2012. She also auditioned for Idol 2008 and received some media attention after being mocked by the judges. Her huge success finally came in 2022 when Jacob went solo and participated in the Melody Festival in 2022 with the song Hold Me Closer, which qualified for the final and later won with 146 points. And to all of you, thank you for doing this with us. We love to do this together with ESC Silver and without you, this would have never been possible. Congratulations Cornelia and congratulations Sweden! Congratulations Sweden!